Hey, what is going on viewers? Zesty Lime Studios here and welcome back to another drinks review. Today we're reviewing another flavour of one of these Rubicon's new energy drinks. So this one is on the Rubicon Raw Energy and this is going to be a raspberry and blueberry flavour. So I got this particular drink out of a random corner shop when I was in Newcastle actually and it cost me £1.29. So I've seen, I'm seeing this pop up about a bit more now in a few more shops, which is good because I've already reviewed the other flavour to this. That will be in the description below once that's public and uploaded. And I've been impressed quite far, so I've got good hopes for this drink as well. But yeah, would you believe it, guys? Would you ever think the day that Rubicon does an energy drink? Neither did I. But here we are, guys. Rubicon have an energy drink. So anyways, let's give you guys a full 360 of the can. So we have quite a, quite a cool simple design but kind of cool so most of the can is basically in two colors with a fade in the middle so we kind of have bluish for the top to represent kind of blueberries and then more of a red on the bottom to represent raspberries and stuff like that and then we have this nice you know gradient fade going in the middle of the two colors fade so it does look really really cool you got a nice shiny color there you got the fade and then you got your more solid blue at the top so the color looks cool there so on the front you've got the picture of the rubicon bird or pigeon or whatever that is on the top there uh, one of the birds and you've got the big raw logo and then the energy again in really cool looking font really artistically uh nice looking font you've got the flavor and then you've got uh made with 20 percent fruit juice and then on the back we have a little bit of a story which you read and then the ingredients on the bottom we have nothing and on the top everything's a standard and silver apart from the pool ring which is a nice shiny red color so taking a close look at the can, so made with 20% fruit juice. So yes, these are basically designed, I guess, to rival the monster juiced and the juiced variants because this is probably the closest um, you're probably gonna get to the monster juiced. So let's read the story. Rubicon Raw is an energy drink that helps you perform at your best with 20% fruit juice, natural caffeine from green coffee beans, B vitamins, ginseng and guana. It's here to help you make the most of every day. Harness your own raw energy and live every moment. So yes, a little bit of a story. Uh, Rubicon is owned by Bar, if you didn't know. Now let's have a look at the ingredients. So what do we have? So we have sugar and sweetener. So these are the full sugar, half sugar, if that makes sense. So uh, per 100 ml, we have 4.5 grams of sugar and per can, it's 23 grams of sugar. So considerably a lot, lot lower than what the monster juiced um, have because then monster juice can contain 50 60 plus grams of sugar which is a lot and from reviewing the other flavor of this rubicon so far it doesn't need all that extra sugar so let's see let's hopefully this one's nice as well here we have niacin between b6 and b12 but no panophenic acid not that it really makes a difference so what actual fruit juice do we have so fruit juice is from concentrate uh 20 we have 9.5 percent apple 4% grape, 1% blackcurrant, 1% raspberry, 1% zesty lime. It doesn't say zesty, it just says lime. Uh, blueberry 1%, passion fruit 0 0.5. So yeah, it doesn't make sense why they've got apple and stuff in there. But remember, they're the cheap fruit and they pad out the overall drink. And because other fruits like blueberry and raspberries are a stronger fruit, you only need a little bit of them to make up the overall drink. Uh, as it has got sweetener, what is the sweetener in this drink? drink hey, where is the sweetener actually um sweetener is super close so no aspartame which is good and the caffeine content is 32 milligrams per 100 ml so it's bang on the average there as well so yeah that's it for the can so it's nice and cold i have got a cup let's get straight into it hopefully it won't explode over me so i'm guessing the color is going to be i guess red it's even going to be red or blue probably red because you're going to think the raspberry is a tad stronger in the color department um, but yeah, I'm guessing red and the smell and taste well, we'll have to find out. Hopefully it doesn't explode over me. Right, really looking forward to this one. There we go. Right. And the colour is... Hey, it's red. As it spits out on my desk. So that's the colour of it. Cool. Quite a lot of foam on the top there, quite a lot of fizz and quite a lot of bubbles on the side as well. So yeah, the color is red, it is cloudy, and it is non-see-through. Just take a close look there of the color for a second. Yeah, almost, I'd say maybe more of a little bit of a candy-ish red, but um, yeah, it's just, just red, no color of blue or anything in there whatsoever. So let's give it a closer smell now and see what we can smell. Oh my 
God, it smells incredible. It smells so fruity and vibrant and just like lush of like, it just smells really, really fruit juicy. Oh, it smells incredible. That literally smells like sherbet, kind of a little bit like a sherbet raspberry kind of smell in a way. You know, you get those little lollies that you dip in like, um, like the kind of sherbet dip lollies, the dip dabs, whatever they call it. It kind of smells like that, but raspberry. And then there's a hint of blueberry smell in there as well, which is nice. Hmm, smells nice. Okay, guys, nevertheless, let's taste some. Wow. They are absolutely incredible. That is so nice. So, so nice. Oh. Mm, that's too good. These are too nice to be an energy drink, man. You're drinking this like it's water. And that's not a good thing when it's an energy drink. Honestly, that is incredibly nice, guys. Oh my God, Monster Juice got to watch out. This stuff's incredible. Oh my goodness. So yeah, it's a really, really nice, superb flavor again. I'm so glad it is because I like the other one. And this one's really nice as well. I've got one more to review, hoping that's going to be superb as well. So yes, another great flavor. Sweetness wise, it's, we'll start with the flavor, I guess the flavor. So to be honest, it has that kind of sherbet taste again. So what I'm getting with this drink is it's got a, sherbet raspberry taste literally like you're dipping dipping the lolly in that kind of you know that that sherbet stuff but raspberry so you literally got a sherbet raspberry taste at the beginning in the midsection of the drink and then after that you've got this nice blueberry flavor kicking in and again remember back in the days of the rockstar extraurance blueberry pomegranate akai the blueberry one it's kind of got that blueberry flavor in the ending of the drink in the aftertaste so you transition from that nice sherbet-y you know strong raspberry flavor at the beginning and then that transitions into this nice kind of blueberry and again a little bit of raspberry flavor at the end but it loses that sherbet kick uh at it loses the, the uh, yeah it loses the sherbet kick after the beginning which is not a bad thing because you get that kick at the beginning and then it and then it flows into the nice blueberry flavor at the end of the drink and for the aftertaste but the sweetness wise even for having half sugar for only having 23 grams or 24 grams of sugar whatever it was it's still got a good amount of sweetness. It's bang on average for the sweetness. But the good thing about this drink is, you know, it hasn't got 50, 60 grams of sugar in that drink. So you're not going to be taking on that amount of sugar in as you'd be drinking like a Monster Juice, for example. But like I said, even though it's half sugar, it still feels like it's a good medium sweetness drink. And that kind of sherbet flavor they've got with the raspberry going on there, it honestly feels like it's a lot more sweeter then for having 24 grams of sugar how much is it because i keep copying myself 23 grams of sugar it honestly feels like it's got more than 23 grams of sugar and that's a good thing because you've still got the sweetness but you've got low sugar and you haven't got any nasty sweetness like aspartame so it's a win-win for everyone so as far as i'm concerned that's a really really real big win and a really well thought out and designed drink from rubicon so but yeah the flavor is incredible in that it's just and i think having the fruit juice real fruit juice in the drink even though it's from concentrate i think that helps with bringing up the overall sweetness of the drink and it helps to bring out like the actual sweet sweetness of the drink itself rather than just pumping it full of i guess maybe other sweeteners or you know in monster's case 50 60 grams of sugar so i think for that whatever blend they've got because you know i look at the monster juice now and i think why does it need 50, 60 grams of sugar? You know, I love the juice. So I love all the new juices that come out recently. You know, the Papillon, the Monarch, the, you know, the Chaotic. They're really, really nice drinks. But they've all got 50, 60 grams of sugar. And then I drink these Rubicons and I think, hang on a minute. These are nicer, if not equal to the Monster Juice. And what would I choose? Well, to be honest, these. Because they're half the sugar. So, yeah, I am really impressed with these Rubicon Raw drinks so far. I really, I really am looking forward to to uh, try on the last one but regardless guys i'll try some out of the can and then i'll finish the video but yeah i'm just amazed by these these are i hope these do come about more i did say this in the other video but i really do hope these find their way into more shops because they really are that nice honestly if you see these pick them up yeah same out of the can that nice sherbet -y, 
raspberry flavor backed up with that nice blueberry aftertaste with a good amount of sweetness in there. Yeah, I absolutely love these drinks. And you know what? That one gets a double thumbs up from Wales. So that's both Rubicon Water Energy drinks, both get double thumbs up so far. Let's hope the third one gets a double thumbs up as well when that's done. Also, when I have reviewed that for people watching this video, that'll be in the description below as well. But as always, guys, thank you for watching. And again, check the description below. You can look at that. You can look at my Twitter, Instagram, uh, TikTok. Or if you want to support me in the channel, you can support my Patreon from as minimum as £1. And all money will go towards drinks and to help the channel. But as always, guys, thank you for watching. And I'll see you all later.